Well, the search for a proper air filter for the Z continues. I had gotten one ordered through Holly. It's just, it's too big. The base of the filter itself was too big to fit in the box. I don't mind the intake. Uh, it looks halfway decent, but you know, it is what it is. I'm not too worried about going with the uh, long tube one to get it out here, because I made this little cover here that is going to seal this in, have the opening for the the bumper which you guys saw so that's going to push air right in but anyway the filter that i got is too big in the base and it hits the bottom of the box and it's just it's not right so i ordered one from z1 motorsports this is for their pop charger damn it this is going to be too big too so you can see it's the inverted style but this is not almost five this, they said it's about five inches the flange is about five inches <laughs> are you kidding me man God damn. God damn it. This pisses me off. They said it's about five inches. It's six inches. Are you fucking kidding me? God damn it. Well, I got $150 worth of fucking air filters that I can't use. Jesus Christ. Well, guys, as I mentioned in a previous video, I'm messing around with preload a little bit more on the Z. Uh, I had to add a little bit to the front because I went with that sort of standard five millimeters of preload prior, but I wanted to add a little bit of rigidity to the front. I also want to bring the front end down about an eighth of an inch, maybe even a quarter. So we got about 10 or 11 total in the front and I'd say a full, a quarter of an inch, just a hair more than a quarter of an inch uh, preload in the rear. I think we're all set. I gotta use this thing as a farm truck today, run some errands, let's get at it. What you know about fitment? Got the little bumper vent installed today too. That's looking pretty sick, should be quite functional. gonna be a farm truck we gotta make it a farm truck Guys, we're at Lowe's with the Z, the farm truck Z. Got some stuff to pick up. <laughs> Let's do this. Let's get a How many can we get in the back? 40. <laughs> 40. They're only like 50 pounds. Farm girl here. Oh, <laughs> oh slinging them. We're gonna be, we're driving in the F 350Z today, so <laughs> if it's a farm truck, you gotta be as tough as a, a farm chick. True. Sand, do it. Four bags. It's best if you take the top one off first. This is all broken. No, it ain't. It puts 
50 pounds a bag. 11 bags of rock. Come on, Susan. I don't know. What? You have your SATs coming up. You better be getting good at math. <laughs> All right. What we need to do first is have a drink of water. I'm not thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> Your park on sale, dollar fifty nine. Right. Truly, what we need to do is stiffen up the rear springs a little. I don't know. We're adding a lot of weight. See, look, look at all this. Look at all this room. Farm truck. I'm gonna stiffen them up all the way. All the way. I to have the, no idea what you just did. See these right here? Little knobs down in there. That's how you adjust the, no. the dampening setting on your coilovers. We're going all the way to the right to make this sucker as stiff as can be. <laughs> Look at that thing! <laughs> Take it easy on the old girl. I got like probably 40 20, bags. Maybe 40 <laughs> bags. Half of the sand. Oh no! It busted. <laughs> You're such a dork. How <laughs> do you like these new seats, by the way? Uh, I like them. You were gone during my review, my full review. Really? Here in Florida. Can so, you turn the car on or something? I don't have air conditioning, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> we have like 600 pounds in the back of this 550 inch rock, and then it's probably it's probably close to 700 pounds. We're sagging a little, but it rides very smooth, doesn't it? It does. Can you tell? It all really the, does. All the bumps are gone. Completely gone. I don't think we're gonna be doing any burnouts. I don't know if it's spin the tires right now. <laughs> probably With all not. this weight in the back. But, we definitely get some grip. We have, what, 15 bags? shade under which to park. I think we found some. There's a couple of things at the Home Depot. Car's not even squatting. Could've got five or six more in there, damn it. Loving these Corbo seats too, by the way. This thing is absolutely killing me. It's hot as balls in here. It's probably only 90 degrees here, but the humidity's like 75%, I'm sure of it. It's just trying to get some yard work done, trying to get some landscaping stuff done, and I sure as hell ain't piling this shit into the Q50, so here we are. 350Z yard truck. F350Z. <laughs> Assess the damage. The tow may. Ah, okay. So we got a we got a loose tow may. Some might say. Not really sure. I don't know. All right. Hit the curb. Let's get to work. The goodies. You know how to unload a farm truck, right? Uh. Do I look like I know how to unload a farm truck? Stop back in. Start tossing it out. So 
Almost the same. <laughs> <laughs> okay, watch the dismount. <laughs> oh, that was crazy. Oh, wait. I forgot my gloves. You look how this thing sits. <laughs> look at that. That is fitment there, man. One finger. One oh finger. Look at this view. Dang. Just the rear. Just the rear. Yeah, it looks good. All right, let's do this. Okay, that might not look good. All right, you can shut it off. <laughs> Yard work's not over. I got still, still some more work to do. Okay, my wife's been on me for weeks now to get this bush pulled out of the back. It's messing with the window and the siding, so I'm gonna tie it up, hook it up to the F350Z, see if we can pull it out of here with all the torques. Terrible. <laughs> there you go. We got the little deck stained or restained. Looking good. Got some more white rock dumped. I need 25 or 30 more bags, probably. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, but she's looking good. We're getting some of these projects done. Sunset is crazy tonight. Successful day at Speed Culture Ranch. The old F350Z didn't let me down at all. Struggle with a little bit of traction. But we got that old tree pulled out of the backyard. Crushed it today, successful day. I appreciate you guys watching. Appreciate the continued support. We got the normal stance back in the Z. And we got the Tomei hook back up. No big deal. You always run into problems out on the ranch. You gotta figure out how to fix them, improvise. We did what we had to do. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys, appreciate it. See you in the next one.